Times here, coming at you with another 12 ounce Tuesday. Sorry I've been so few far and in between, but I've been an extremely busy guy. I'm telling you, I've got more projects going on, oh my god. Betty says that I make too big of a mess with that big silver salt shaker I usually use, so she got me this one right here. You can see it or not. It says beer salt on it. It's got kind of a lemony taste to it. Not too bad. Boy, I sure have been getting a lot of comments on that uh, Craigslist prank call I did about the uh, Big Johnson. <laughs> oh boy. I've had phone calls, video responses. Uh, Responses, not video responses, but so I don't know. Not a huge amount of views, so uh, maybe uh, <laughs> maybe it was uh, a little distasteful and uh, not appreciated so much. <laughs> Fuck it up! I have I've never I haven't done a prank call since I was a teenager. So I've seen guys like Ed Bassmaster doing it all the time, but he's like a pro. I mean, he sets people up pretty good. You know, what the hell? Try to do something a little different, kind of funny. Uh, uh, I don't know. So, oh my God! You know what? There is something very, very serious. Hold on, I gotta. You know what? I'm gonna play you guys the uh, first song I ever, ever wrote. I was 18 years old. I wrote this song. I played with this band. Hope you can hear it. Hope it's not too loud. But, let's see. Let me get my phone here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to count down the days. Okay, so today is the fourth of the month. So we got one, two, that's 14, 15, 16, 17 days. Will be December 21st. 2012, there's probably a lot of you uh, out there that know what I'm talking about. There might be people out there that have no idea what I'm talking about. But, you know, like the Mayan calendar and actually the Chinese and several other uh, um, religions have predicted the same date thousands of years ago when they were... Uh, Basically, didn't have very strong communication with one another, long distances of travel. But there's been several predictions, uh, at least two or three solid predictions on that, uh, especially with the Mayans, that December 21st, 2012, that it will, it's like at the end of the Mayan calendar, like it's going to be the end of humanity or civilization as we know it. Uh, there's a lot of uh, ancient alien theories behind uh, a lot of this stuff. Um, and so I don't know, uh, what do you guys think is going to happen on December 21st, 2012, 17 days from now? You think There'd be a big giant freak out on the internet and all over the world, and news and everything else about, well, you know, the planets are supposed to line up, the sun and the and the earth and this black hole. I mean, they say that, you know, scientifically, astrologically, that we could actually be sucked into a black hole. Because on that day, the planets would be all aligned perfectly for something like that to happen. Um, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Some people say that it's just a, uh, with the Mayan calendar, that it's just the beginning of a new calendar, which is a beginning of new times, and uh, like times of change, like things are going to change, and we're going to go into another era, or you know, some sort, so I don't know. I don't know what to think about it. 
Does anybody out there know anything about this? Does anybody out there uh, believe in, in any of these theories? Um, I have my own thoughts and beliefs. And um, uh, I think something, I think there's a high probability that something will happen. You know, in my opinion, uh, well, with my high hopes is maybe it's just a, a sign of a new time and lots of change. Maybe it be technology or, you know, something along those lines. Hopefully December 21st and 22nd will just be another day as we know it, but we make advancements or maybe that's the beginning of the new next high technology generation. Maybe it's the end of the world, I don't know. But hopefully it's just another day. Um, it's been lots of profits that have made predictions. That uh, yeah, you can uh, take them from what they are. A lot of them are very general, and then they just a lot of people decide to you know say, well, that he was talking about this event or that event or whatever. But uh, you know, really, uh, this is a, a pretty serious matter with, uh, with a lot of people. Um, I certainly think about it seriously, um, and you know. I'm thinking about taking a day off. <laughs> Go out to the pig barn, play this song right here, and a bunch of others. Drink a few beers out there, out in the middle of nowhere. Closest house is about a mile away. Go out there and drink some beers out in the middle of nowhere, out in the middle of the wilderness. Look at the stars in the sky. See what happens. You know. If something does go down, I'll be in a beautiful place to go, you know? <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know what to think. You guys tell me your opinion. I'd love to, uh, I'd love to hear them. Um, trying to pick another song here. Because uh, I'm not doing my beer yet, but... Oh, Kevin has got the new um, Madden NFL two, uh, 2013. Um, Kick-ass game, by the way. I'm not really big into video games, but um, this one is... If you like football, it's a really good game. Okay, here's another one. Um, not original, but just an old band from a long time ago. Play with three piece. Um, but he got the new uh, Madden uh, NFL 13 or whatever the hell they call it. You can play people online. It's really cool. Um, I've only got about four or five games in. I still suck pretty bad. But you look on there, and there's like 30, 40, 50 thousand people playing all at the same time, online against each other. It's pretty cool. Then you got this new uh, um, Black Ops. It just come out like in November. It's the latest, greatest shit. And about three or four other ones. And man, I'm going to tell you what, man. Video games sure have changed since I was a kid. I mean, I'm telling my age here, but I remember back when Atari come out, and you had like the, the little squirt, little triangle, and you would shoot at the boulders, you know, called asteroids, you know. Uh, that was like the most awesome thing, and you could move it and accelerate and turn and shoot and stuff. You know, and then the little pong thing, you know, where you play the, the bounce the ball back and forth. I mean, it was just that simple back then. Um, then there were some handheld devices like the basketball and football, were, which they were handheld, you know, about the size of a big cell phone or something and uh, you would push buttons and they were just dots on there and you could pass or run or and they were just like a dot or like a line uh, boy things sure have changed since then but uh, yeah um, shit the controllers and all that stuff 
Um, he's pretty good at it. That's not really my thing, but I'm a Cowboys fan, and so I've kind of taken a little bit of interest in playing the football game. And, you know, it's just good quality family time, hanging out with your kid and doing something he likes to do, you know. But, uh, been, uh, luckily business has picked up lately. Uh, one of my biggest accounts is back from vacation, thank God. And, uh, we're rock and rolling, uh, doing lots of good quality work. No major complaints, things are actually running pretty smooth ahead of schedule. Uh, I don't know, man. Um, that's really about it. Got the building put on slow down for a while. Got to save up some more loot because I'm going to make it a little nicer than I intended. But when it's done, it's going to be sweet. It's going to be a cost me about two or three times as much to renovate the place, but when I get done, it's going to be sweet. So, anyway, I think I've rambled on enough tonight. Uh, seen a lot of you guys like Fear the Victor and uh, um, Jack Herbation did a video response to him tonight. Um, there's uh, two or three guys doing 24 ounce Tuesday, um, and uh, I think it's pretty cool. Um, uh, been watching a lot of Fear of the Victors videos lately. Uh, it's kind of one of a new channel that I, I've been, uh, you know, kind of watching more. I guess I've been subscribed to him for a, quite a while, but I tend to watch more and more of his videos. He's, uh, you know, doing different stuff and, you know, getting into it a little bit more and, uh, had a lot going on. A uh, good channel. You guys could check him out, you know. Well... That's really about all I got this week, guys. Not not a whole lot going on. Spending time with family, working hard, trying to make my way through life. Speaking of life, hopefully we're all alive on December 22nd. Let me know your opinions on this. This really matters to me. It really does. Um, you know... Does it have anything to do, you know, with religion, or is it scientific? Is it aliens? What do you guys think? There's lots of different uh, perspective per, per, perspectives on uh, what's going to happen December 24th, 17 days from now. So, you guys, let me know what you think is going to happen. Cheers, and thanks for watching.